And now behind us, we have work by Lauren Brinson. Um, socks, bra and magnum, edible woman and Mars, and underwear and hairbrush. And this is a suite of works in salvaged yarn and plastic mesh with hand embroidery. Lauren, I'll turn it over to you. Thanks, Marcy. My name is Lauren Brinson, and I'm an interdisciplinary, interdisciplinary artist from Newfoundland and Labrador working in Victoria, BC. And this is a series of, rug, of rugs that I made in 2017, shortly after graduating the visual arts program in Grenfell Campus in Newfoundland, where I learned how to hook rugs in a sculpture class. And I was thinking about how rug hooking went from this utilitarian craft of poverty to art as an object once rugs and mats started being mass produced industrially. And in that transition, they went from being placed on the floor to being displayed on the wall. And so thinking of rug hooking's history as traditionally women's work and also sitting in that in-between space of useful and decorative, I started making to scale uh, rug versions of things that were on my bedroom floor. And they're all functionless mimics of useful objects or discarded wrappers of consumable things. Um, yeah, bra, underwear, hairbrush, socks, candy bar wrapper, condom wrappers, and the book is Margaret Atwood's The Edible Woman. Um, and after listening to Trish Johnson's description of the materials in her wonderful rugs, I thought I'd mention mine as well. Uh, materials traditional to Newfoundland, uh, the base historically was often burlap because it was plentiful and easy to find from food bags. And they often used uh, offcuts of yarn from weaving mills or knitted clothing that couldn't be used anymore and was unraveled and hooked into rugs. Uh, and mine are made from yarn that I thrifted uh, and thrifted items that I unraveled. And some are hooked into burlap and some into a plastic mesh that I had easy access to from my father, who is a, a sign and awning maker. It's this uh, white plastic mesh that usually goes like underneath an awning, um, but is great for hooking rugs. Uh, so my material goal was to keep the traditional spirit of using what's on hand while being able to modify it to fit a contemporary practice. Thanks. <laughs> 